Well, every three and a half minutes in the state of Texas, a violent crime takes place. Tonight, the Gregg County DA's office hosted its fourth annual Tree of Angels event to honor victims of violent crimes. KLTV's Avery Niles was at the event and brings you more. In the 188th District Courtroom in the Gregg County Courthouse, Families and friends of victims who lost their lives in violent crimes gathered to remember their loved ones by placing an ornament in their honor on a Christmas tree. John Moore, the Gregg County District Attorney, says the idea of the Tree of Angels was created in 1991 in Austin, Texas. During the holidays, everybody always wants to be around their family. Well, unfortunately, in too many situations, their family's taken away from them. The celebration included music, a proclamation written by the county judge, prayers, and the tree adornment and lighting. Moore says it's a way for the victims to be remembered and the family to find peace. Too often in society, especially in the district attorney's office and courthouse, uh, it seems that the focus is on the defendants and not the victims. This is a way for the families of violent crime victims to actually celebrate and remember their, their loved ones. Pam Mason and Kay Stewart were in attendance honoring their sister and daughter, Gail Sandage, who was killed after being stabbed by an assailant at Good Shepherd Ambulatory Surgery Center in 2013. And this helps, I think, people to heal. And because we are remembering, we're remembering the victim, we're remembering their names. They're a part of us, they're a part of our family. Avery Niles, KLTV 7 News. The tree will be moved out into one of the hallways of the courthouse and it will stay there throughout the Christmas season.